distant time and faraway place, the planet of New Texas floats deep in space. Sky of three suns, land of precious ore, the carrion rush brought outlaws by the score. A lawman appeared with powers of pop, wolf, puma, and bear. Protector of peace, mystic man from afar. Champion of justice, Marshal Brave Star. Star should have come with us on this trip. Ah, the prairie people out here are shy. I can't get a story about their lives if too many people come along and scare them off. The outlaw they call Howler has been spotted around here. If he sees Brave Star around, I'll never get a picture of him. Mmm, <laughs> Weedle McBride finds out we've been following him. I told him I wouldn't go with him. Never said I wouldn't follow him. What worries me is that I might have come all the way out here for nothing, because most of the time, nothing happens out here. What's that? Unless I miss my guess, that, my dear, is Howler. Friendly hello from Sarah Jane here, too. You'd be Howler. I've heard about you. Then you know everybody comes in my territory pays the price. Even a galactic marshal. This is Prairie People Land, and we heard you was robbing them. Everybody got to pay, Howler, including the Prairie People. <laughs> That's what you think, Dingo! <laughs> Dad, let's take cover. You good little fairy. <laughs> they want a ride? Sarah Jane will send them for a ride. <laughs> A leaper with frozen feet. And a leaper who can't leap. Here comes more of them two-legged coyotes. Strength of the bear. 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 Canyon! Oh! 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 There they are. 
they go like a bunch of scared jackrabbits. You'll pay for this, Marshal, next time we meet. <laughs> I thought I said I didn't want an escort on this trip, Marshal. Been looking for this Howler fellow for a while now. Well, I was glad to see you in 3030. And while he won't admit it, so was my father. Well, well. I am the mayor of Forgotten Tribe. Thank you, Marshal. You drive away the bad bingos. But now they know our secret entrance places. Next time, Howler will attack us. There won't be a next time. I'm going to bring Howler and his gang in. Who might this be? That is Wimble. Wimble's parents far away. Prairie People Law says he choose new parent until real parent return. Hmm, he picks his own parents? That's some kind of funny setup. Oh, oh Wimble choose you for new daddy. Oh, that's right. Huh? Yeah, leg on my leg. He has chosen you. Chosen me for what? Playground? Yeah, 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 somebody explain to this kid that I ain't no merry-go-round horse. He's chosen you to be his temporary father. Mm, but consarn it, I ain't cut out to be nobody's daddy. <laughs> What's so darn funny, Marshal? Well, now that you mention it, nothing. Child care is serious. Mm, I'll say it's serious. And I don't want no part of this. Uh, sorry, 3030, but we're in prairie people country, and so we abide by prairie people laws. I just don't see how I can. 3030 smart. Know everything. Teach Wimble. Oh, it w well, not everything. <clears throat> I, I reckon I can teach you a few things. Maybe it won't be so bad. Animals going to be taking care of a prairie people boy. Find a way to get the kid. We can use him to set a trap for Brave Star. Brave Star! And this here is how you cock it. Well, we'll see. Now, just watch me. Mm -hmm. Don't mind saying you're right. Now, you take a close look at this, but be careful. He's right, Wimble. Guns are dangerous. In fact, Bard, I wonder if you ought to be showing him how to use it and letting him touch it. Mm -hmm. I'm also showing him how not to use it. Plus which, guns are important on New Texas. Brains and guts are more important. Guns should be used as a last resort. You know, you're supposed to be taking care of Wimble. Mmm, consarn it. I know how to take care of people. I can't agree with you. I've been taking care of you long enough. We don't have any time to argue now. Gotta get back to Fort Carrion. Freeze! Shaman, me and 3030 had an argument today. A pretty serious one. It just doesn't feel right to be arguing with a big part. Mm, I remember that you had a fight with a friend when you were a boy. I'm telling you, it was an accident. I didn't mean to hit you with the anti-gravity ball. I don't believe you, Dana. You never care about anyone else. Are you calling me a liar? <laughs> Shaman, you... you knew we were fighting? I sensed the anger in your spirit. You know I don't allow fighting, and pointless fighting too. For I have looked into Dana's mind. He is innocent. I'm sorry. I shouldn't be so quick to judge people. After the argument with Dana was over, you were closer friends than before, because you understood each other better. I reckon if friends can't argue a little, they aren't real friends. Thanks, Shaman. Why, hello, buddy, buddy. 
Hey, howdy, Miss Jenny. Uh, I got a new student for your school. This here is Wimble. might attach to me. Welcome to our school, Wimble. Go ahead, son. I'll come and pick you up after school. Uh, do it for me, please. Uh, for dirty, dirty Wimble go school. So Wimble's going to school. Nice going. Yup. And uh, I'm gonna miss a little guy. Say, big part, I was a mite hard on you before, and, well, I just want to say you're the best part a marshal could have. Mm -hmm. Oh, mount up. I've wasted enough time with that nicey nice stuff today. Let's go. We've got to track down Haller. <laughs> student is from the far desert, that's where we'll go today on a field trip. Wimble can tell us all about it. Him? What does he know? He's just a funny-talking savage! <laughs> you talk funny! Easy, Wimble. They'll learn to appreciate you in time. If I do this just right, they'll run out of fuel and they'll have to land in Howler's territory. Okay, everybody, put on your seatbelt. <laughs> well, children, it won't be long now before... There's something wrong with the bus jet. We're losing power. Got to bring it in for an emergency land. All right, everybody. Check your seatbelts. We're going to land. <laughs> Getting a Mayday emergency signal. <laughs> it's from Jenny. I'm picking it up now, too. Her bus jet's gone down. Jenny to Fort Carrion. We're down safe and sound. Does anyone read me? Bravestar here. I read you, Jenny. Glad you're okay. What are your coordinates? Losing contact. Position is 36 LC 18. I lost contact. Didn't get the rest of her location. But at least everyone's all right. Park. You head for 36 Alpha 18. Search in that quadrant. Well, that's a big area. Could take days. <clears throat> no, I'm going back to town for the hover glide. I'll cover it all by air. See you later. Mm, a power jump ought to give me a good head start. <laughs> Speed of the Puma. The Puma. The Puma. <laughs> puts us in the far desert, near Ambush Canyon, right in the middle of Howler's territory. That smoke ought to be from the school mom's bus. Yeah, <laughs> right where we want it. I think Fort Carrium is that way. No, uh, Fort, Fort Carrium... Huh, what do you know about it? Wimble crosses desert lots of times. 
I think we should trust Wimble. He's trained for the desert. Carry him too far. We go ferry people for each first. Only 30 echo miles. 30? Oh, no. Let's go for help. I'm not sure they got our location. If they did, they can follow our tracks. Wimble, lead the way. You have a guide, now, you. That ought to give me enough altitude to search for Miss Jenny. Uh -oh. Looks like trouble. Enough shot won't miss. Now hand over your money. <laughs> money has to be earned, boys. Only thing I'll know, Jones, is you. I told you we shouldn't have done nothing in town but what Howler told us. Shut up and shoot. <laughs> You tell me what Howler's planning, you'll get a cell in my jail. But if you don't tell me, I'll see to it you go to the prison planet. You wouldn't like it there. We set up school's jet to run out of fuel so it land in Howler's territory. Then there's no time to waste. Uh, I'm... I'm so hot. I'm so thirsty. I'm sorry, Judy. We will show you water. Oh, sure. Here? This must be the driest place in the whole galaxy. You're wrong. But that could be poisonous. No, Miss Jenny. Wimble know this plant good. This water cactus pod. Now for something to eat. No, that plant poison. Never eat plants you don't know. Gee, I guess you do know some stuff after all. Who's that? Well, well, looky here, boys. Get them! Don't you dare touch them! bothering her friends. You come one step closer to this boy, and I'll... You do what? No time to radio Brave Star. Sure hope he shows up. Think I heard Sarah Jane to the northeast. Changing course. Come on, Brave Star. Circle around them. Oh, no. Look. They're coming at us from every direction. See, that lever attack was just a trick. Now I gotcha. Oh, you're going to get Howler as a stiff jail sentence. Brave Star, it's about time. Sure is, big part. Let's take him. Get the keys. Use them for shields. Oh, yeah? Speed of the Puma. The Puma. The Puma. For a perfect strike. Out your problem all wrapped up. Well, class, what did you learn today? I learned there's all different kinds of people. 
and they're all good at different things, like Wimble. Yeah, I guess you shouldn't judge somebody before you know them real well. Yep, and sometimes disagreeing with friends is how you get to know them better. And now I know 3030 makes a pretty good daddy. Well, I'm only doing this for a short while, till he finds somebody else, like maybe 20 or 30 years. <laughs> <laughs>